Hey y'all, 2016 Cavalcade of Cool at the Auctions American Park in Auburn, Indiana. And I got a 1954 Chevrolet Suburban 3800 Street ride I think y'all are gonna enjoy. Let me get the camera turned around and we'll take a quick look at it. Gary, thanks so much for bringing it out, brother. Well, enjoyed it. Uh, glad to be a nice day out here. It is beautiful, isn't it? Tell me a little bit about it. Well, like I said, I've had it 31 years and uh, an electrician used to have it. My dad used to have two of them when we put up antennas and towers, so that's what got me inspired on those. And for kids that don't know, people used to have TV antennas and towers at their house. We didn't have cable, that's and right. the taller the better, and you know, you uh, moonraker or whatever on top of it. But, yep. Yeah, no. That's so what, you use that in this business? Well, right? I use it in my cleaning business. Wow. Yeah, I use that quite a bit. Hold carpet machines in the back and, and different equipment back there. And, and it's got ghosted flames on it. Yep. It's hard to see those guys. I don't know if they're if they're showing in the sun or not, but yeah, some it's I've, kind I've of a pearl, maybe? kind of a pearl yeah. in there. Yep. No, and that's... you don't see any of these things. No, like I said, I've had it for 31. I've only seen three, and one of them was triced out. So right. What uh, shape was this one in when you got it? Well, it was an excellent shape. The yeah. guy had it, and there were probably wasn't a handful of mud in the whole thing. No okay. kidding. And uh, it's uh, that paint job's been on there 30 years. 30 years. Rob has touched it up. Right. Uh, and. Uh, and clear coated it once and that's about it holy cow i wonder what product that is i don't know what really <laughs> be good to know isn't yeah. it it's held years. up real well it's hold, held up really well yeah and, like, and because it was so straight there's not much much work and body work in it much to body work or whatever, and yeah. uh, you know i keep it inside you know it's inside all winter and stuff like that so is it on air uh it's got airbags in the back and okay. they put a new scott's hot rod front end on the front We've lowered this from the original about eight inches. Okay. Holy cow, that's a lot, right? Yeah. yeah. But it was a heavy duty truck. Heavy duty truck, yeah. It rode like a lumber wagon. It rides better now? No, it rides a lot better. Just Still working on it, like we said, Still folks. Still working, yeah. Like I said, we've, uh, our future plan is actually to paint the dash and everything black and the outside a black and gray two tone to go with the interior. Oh, so you're going to paint it again? Yeah. I kind of like it the way it is, but. I know a lot of people have told me that, so. But I'm sure you got a better idea. Yeah. Yeah. It, it's coming. So. And then you got uh, Dakota Digital in there? Dakota Digital. I did it steering column. Right. And the Kenwood stereo system. I just got the air hooked up the other day to Vintage Air. Thank goodness for that. Well, I tell you, it blowed cold coming down as first time. So it'll be interesting to see how it gets in the back. Well, you can always put ducks and stuff back yeah, there. Yeah, I just put an auxiliary back yeah, there. Yeah, no kidding. But, uh, no, I can't wait. That's going to be cool. You're eventually going to put carpet in. Carpet in, and we're yeah. building the console to put all the air. Put the air. I just got it stuffed behind there now. A couple of ducks, and the other ones are over here. But we'll build a panel underneath and, and put a nice console in and uh, put some incorporating some of that off the day. It's got a sunroof. It's got a sunroof. Wow. Yeah. You're well on your way, brother. It's coming. Yeah, just a matter of time. Dude, that's the party wagon back here. Yeah, it. Uh, we just got that done and makes it a lot more comfortable now. No, oh, that is and nice with a couch, a table. It's got cup holders in it. You got, got strobe lights and stuff too. Got side lights on there, a little mood lights on there right. to get the mood going. A little extra storage for the DVD player and TV and Dude, and this, uh, might, this would get me in trouble. Yeah, it's what the yeah they it's could to happen. Be careful, <laughs> it could happen. <laughs> but. Uh, yeah, no, that's nice though. And who thinks about putting a couch in? You must have a little custom van blood in you. Maybe, yeah, right? I think I used to have vans back in the seventies. <laughs> quite a go. few of them. No, yeah. That was a great idea though. You didn't put, you know, cut holes in it and put windows or anything. You just left it a panel like that. Yeah, no, that's dude. That is really cool. And then you got the TV up in the yeah, ceiling. Yeah, got TV, DVD player, so you can listen to music both the front and back. And uh, it's fun, fun at parties and things like that. Sure. What's going on under here, Gary? Well, we um, got a 350 board out, aluminum heads and everything, um, four barrel, and with the air and put that nice belt system up front. And uh, we smoothed the firewall. Oh yeah. And plugged all the holes in the fender wells and uh, smoothed all it out. We just got some little touches to do there yet. And I did have a 671 blower on it. And uh, How many horse is it now, you think? Oh, it's probably close to 400. That's good. Yeah, yeah it's good not bad. Driving, I just right, get manageable. down the road, right. use it on some trips now. And you could actually change. pull a trailer or something. Oh, yeah. yeah. Yeah, actually, I think about putting a little hitch on there. You might as well. And, uh, but no, we, we enjoyed it, cleaned it all up, and uh, it makes a difference, you know, the way it looks. No, I like that. It looks good. And it's yeah. got the polish more than the chrome on it, right? Right. Yeah. yeah. No, I like that. No, yeah. nice job for sure. 
So there you go, from the 2016 Cavalcade of Cool, Auctions America Park, Auburn, Indiana. A 1954 Chevrolet Suburban 3800. Hope you all enjoyed it. See ya!